Isedu Keita was an African photographer, a portrait photographer, who had a studio in Mali in the capital, Bamako, during the uh, 1940s and 50s. He wasn't shy about saying what he felt had happened in his portrait photos, which was really that he'd actually managed to invent the three-quarter angle head and shoulder shot. This was a claim he made. And even though it isn't strictly true, there's some meaning to it because there is an immense difference between the kind of work that studio photographers like Cato were doing and the colonial photograph of native persons. What you really feel about Cato's portraiture is that you're fully in the presence of a consenting sitter. And Cato ran the studio as a kind of theatre. He had jewellery, he had wristwatches, quite good ones, he had two-piece suits for the men, he had sets of lavish costumes and jewellery for, for the women, he had bicycles, he had a Vespa scooter, he had his own Peugeot 21, and between the sitter and the portrait maker there is a very lively collaboration in a kind of theatre of aspiration about what people could become what they will become as colonialism comes to an end.